Hey guys, what's going on? It's Dokonic here, and today we are going to be doing another Boss Rush video. This is Boss Rush 1 on Super 2. This is the one we're going up against all the first generation Dokon exclusive events. So, um, I'm bringing my Heroes team on this one again. If you saw yesterday's video, well, I'm recording this on Monday night. Uh, so, technically yesterday's video, because this is going up on Tuesday. But essentially what I wanted to do, I kind of wanted to like the countdown. So I did Super 1, Super 2, and then on third Wednesday is going to be the Stage 2 Super uh, Super 2. And then we're going to be doing maybe Super 3, depending on how well that goes tomorrow night. Uh, anyway, so, this is what we're doing right now. Uh, got, we're going up against the Broly. Uh, again, Heroes team. I think this is the one I ran yesterday. Actually, I brought the Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta, I believe, yesterday's video. I had in the uh, technique, the technique Vegeta, the Vegito. Uh, I decided to change it up just because it's a little bit longer. So I wanted to make sure I had a defender. I, uh, I think I ran the uh, Super Two on which am I call it? What am I trying to say here? I can't even think. Uh, I ran Super Two on the second round on the second boss rush stage with a hero team. I was able to do it without a problem. So. Uh, that's not tomorrow, that's not Wednesday's video though, but Wednesday's is my villains team just because it's more self-reliant. And I kind of wanted to test the difference and see which one would do better over the other. So, yeah, don't worry about that. Alright. But yeah, by the way, happy 4th of July because the day that this is going up, it's going to be the 4th of July. Uh, hope you all are planning on partying and having safe, good fun. I am going to be working all day, so no partying for me, unfortunately. Uh... Yeah, we're just... Uh, yeah, good thing is about working in IT, though. I work in IT, if you don't know. Uh, on holidays, you go in and literally no one's calling in, so... Tomorrow's not going to be bad. You go in, I'll finish up most of my work. Oh, look at that. Additional attack. Nice. I'm going to finish most of my work, and then, you know, it'll be a relaxed day. Cool, my probably's dead. The first, like, five bosses, I'm just going to breeze right through. I think that Gohan is the only one who might give me a little bit of a problem but I'm not too concerned with it. Anyway, so there was supposed to be some type of event. There was an in-game announcement in the news, and it had said that there was going to be a poll that was supposed to come to take place. I remember it on the JP side. I remember people talking about it on the JP side. Uh, I haven't seen anything about it yet. I don't know what's going on with that. I don't know if it was maybe a typo or if it was supposed to come out later. Um, it came out, or if it came out earlier than it was actually supposed to. I'm waiting for that poll, because essentially it, it, it tells you, or saying, what would you rather have to pull on? Would you rather pull, or not pull on, have a Shenron wish for? Would you rather your Shenron wish be for Elder Kai's, potential orbs, or reversals? Now, I don't know how many potential orbs you get of each kind, but I know it's um, four Elder Kai's, if you choose Elder Kai's, and the other one is ten reversals. Now, the thing is, reversals, they're grindable, so I would definitely not pick that at all. So I could just go to 18.3 or 21.1 and grind it out whenever I want to. Potential orbs, while it would be nice to have more orbs, they are technically grindable without a problem. All you have to do is, you know, wait for the event to come out. It just takes a little bit of patience. So, and then you typically give us a good amount of potential orbs whenever there's a new uh, 120 lead that comes out. So if you guys are not expecting to go for every single 120 lead, in my opinion, it's not really worth it then, because you're not going to be going for all the 20 leads, so you're going to have a whole bunch of orbs. I know on my JP side, I have like 2,500 um, uh, technique orbs, like 2,500 physical orbs. I never used it because I never had any of them, so I never used it on any of the, uh, the actual uh, cards because I never pulled any of them except for the Super Saiyan 4s. And the Super Saiyan 4s, uh, what, what I have of them, I, I didn't get any dupes or anything, but I got all them maxed out, and I got like my Gogeta, uh, all, the, all of what he has maxed out, my Super Vegito Blue, uh, my Super Vegito, that is, the Agility one, he's maxed out as well, uh, at least on the JP side. So, that's actually one of the goals that I'm going... Hmm. Yeah, that's, that's fine. That's fine. There's that. Three here. I want to try and make sure that I have a whole bunch of orbs. Uh, available for the next round. Actually, I'm not going to have to worry about it next round because this boo is going to die with my Gotenks attack. Man, I can't wait to get this Gotenks like, maxed out, fully maxed out, and fix up his damn dupe system. I need to trade in those double attacks for the uh, the crit system. Because he doesn't double, d double attack more than enough. I mean, he doesn't double attack enough to make, make up for it. 
Uh, all right. Oh well. There's that, and then we're gonna be, we get the agility orb, and then the physical orb for go tanks get some health. Oh, but I don't even need the health healing. So maybe if I get lucky and I get enough double super attacks, I'll be good, and I'll get uh, I'll get kill boo before even the next round. Okay, great. Come on, get another super attack. Additional super. Oh uh, no. Damn, I only got two attacks on that too. Come on, Gogeta, don't let me down. 100%, baby. Nice. Sorry, I'm just taking a sip of water here. 1.2 million. So, I ended up getting this pop filter, and the pop filter does not do enough to block my breathing and block how I speak. Especially when I pronounce my S's, sometimes I just get too high pitched in trouble. <laughs> um, anyway, so I just ended up taking a sock. And I threw it over my pop filter. I did it about a week ago, and I'll tell you, I've gotten some pretty damn good results. Um, I do. Uh, I don't know. So I, I really need to invest in some better equipment here. But I'm just I can't spend the money. I can't afford to spend the money on that right now. There's no reason for me to. I mean, yeah, you know what? For what I'm doing, everything works right now. I'm able to broadcast videos. I'm able to edit videos. I'm able to show you gameplay and give you event reviews. There's no reason for me to upgrade anything. Live streaming, though, that's a different story. I would like to start live streaming for you guys, but I can't do it on my system. Um, I did try, try some recording with OBS. I know there's a couple other free ones. I haven't tried them out yet, but I tried doing it at 60 frames.